So we try to think what are the drivers that created this change of awareness? Because no one really does that with, without feeling guilt, even if you did. Throw things out the window with disregard. In fact, there's some interesting scenes in Mad Men, which of course takes place in the 60s. You just see them doing things, wow, did we do that? People walk into an elevator smoking a cigarette, did we do that? And they finish a picnic and they toss everything on the ground, did we do that? So, so why did all this change? What happened in the late 60s? And uh, we go to 1968, the most turbulent year of a turbulent decade, assassinations, the Tet Offensive, the anti-war movement, and in that year, this photo was published. Yes. Oh. Earthrise, Apollo 8. They went to the moon, orbited a dozen, 15 times, and then came back, snapped this picture. This was published in 1968, and we see Earth as nature intended us to view it, yeah. like with oceans and mm -hmm. land and clouds. We go to the moon to explore the moon, and we discover Earth for the first time. And I looked at what happened after this photo was taken. In the four years that we were going to the moon, 68, 69, 70, 71, and into 72, five years, excuse me, <laughs> end of 68 into 72, that's when all of this happened. Yeah. Yeah. When was the Environmental Protection Agency founded? 70. 1970, right. okay? When was Earth Day founded? 70. 1970. Right. When we were going to the moon then, and we had other issues in 1970, right. all right? There were assassinations and, and unrest on college campuses, and all of a sudden, people started thinking about Earth. Earth. Right. 1972, the catalytic converter is introduced. Leaded gas is banned. DDT is banned, 1973. All these early years of the decade. The Comprehensive Clean Air Act and Clean Water Act, all was in that period. So I'm thinking, we go to space, and why, why are we going to space? We, we, we need space <laughs> for. There's one other really cool thing about that image. It was, uh, you, know, not, you know how the NASA missions are so scripted, they, you know, they plot out Yeah, everything. yeah, yeah. That was unanticipated, and, and when you listen to the, the dialogue that took place, it was, hey, get the camera, quick. No one had actually said, hey, we're gonna come around the backside of the moon and see the Earth. They didn't it, even think to think I that. And I love the idea that that, that, that appreciation, the, the narrative power of that, actually was more important than the mission part of, of it.